We've been seeing a few leaks about the new AirPods over the last couple of weeks, but last night, Apple finally went ahead and announced it officially. These are the new Apple AirPods Pro. Apple's passed me a unit to test them out, and while I haven't had a chance to exhaustively test them out, here are five things that you need to know about the new Apple AirPods Pro. The new AirPods Pro costs 999 dirhams, and that gets you a case with wireless charging. Compared to the non-Pro model, which costs 829 dirhams with the wireless charging case, you're not paying a whole lot more for these new models. Apple has updated the design for the AirPods as well as the charging case. The stem on the new AirPods Pro is shorter, and you now have silicone tips that makes them more comfortable and secure in your ear. They're also lighter than last year's model. I wasn't a big fan of the original AirPods, they weren't very comfortable in my ear and kept falling down, but the new silicon tips and the lighter weight on the AirPods Pro help them stay in my ear and a lot more comfortable. The new charging case is wider than the older one, but not as tall. It is about the same as far as pocketability is concerned from the previous one, slightly larger than that. The new AirPods Pro support noise cancellation, and this is done through a combination of two things. First, the silicon tips are a tighter fit, which allows less noise to go into your ear and seals them. And second, there are two microphones, one facing outwards and one facing inwards that help cancel the noise. There's now a transparency mode that lets you listen to outside noise when you're wearing the AirPods. This allows you to carry a conversation with someone even with the AirPods on. I've tested this feature on other earphones such as the Sony WF-1000XM3 and have found it a bit more gimmicky than useful. How well it works on the AirPods is something I'll find out after using them for a bit longer, but my initial reaction is that they work better than the Sony's I've tried. The new AirPods Pro are sweat and water resistant, which allows them to use them while you're working out without any worry. They are IP certified, but you can go swimming with them. Rain is completely fine. Not that we get much of that here in Dubai though. The tighter fit with the silicon tips also helps them keep in your ear longer than the standard plasticky AirPods that I've never managed to stay put for more than 20 minutes. I'm sure there's a lot more to talk about the new AirPods Pro once I've tested them over the next few days. Stay tuned to techradar.com for the full review.